big chef. I'm in the kitchen. It's not hot yet, but trust me, in a little bit, they are going to be burning. Welcome once again. It's a beautiful, delicious Sunday. And OMG, I cannot wait to see the kids, you know, do a little something, something. Well, you already know I'm your host, Movi Hayford, but as you popularly know, I am Movi the Motivator. We're going to add a lot of spice to this show, a lot of burning, a lot of oil from Frital, yes, the cholesterol-free oil. Of course, our sponsor, Indomie. Mmm, tastes great. Of course, Dole yogurt. Now, if you don't know these three brands, it means that you are eating unhealthily. The kids are going to teach you a thing or two about these brands as we go along. But as you know, last week, something beautiful happened. We chose our 12 disciples of the Big Chef. And I'm going to give you a little taste for those of you who didn't catch it. Here is some info for you. Back in a second. <laughs> Okay, so my very first contestant, Clifford Okanse. Behind you, let's clap for them. Let's clap. Well done, guys. You did very well, and I would love to taste more food from you. So make sure you're starting your little businesses on the side. We're going to have fun, okay? Big chefs on three, two, one. Burn! What, what, what is this? I'm taking some people home. Are you going home? And so Kiara, you're going home. Nana, you have to step forward. That's nice. And then, Mami, I step forward too. So, thank you so much for coming through. I love your dishes. And you are all saved. It's a lie! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh my God! Naughty, naughty! <laughs> Welcome back, and I know you were shocked just like the kids. You should have seen their faces. Funny enough, I was more scared than they were, honestly. But these kids have thick skin. I don't know whether they've been to other competitions or what, but they seem as if they have experience with this whole thing. I don't even have experience with it. But you know what? One person who does, I'm sure, because they've been burning for a long time now, is my, should I say, main judge. Yes, of course, none other, but Chef Adipa. Welcome once again. And I'm blessed. I mean, you're going to make sure they give us good food. So I'm set for that. How are you? Very fine. How, how was your stomach that Sunday? It was OK. Some people actually wanted to deflate my <laughs> belly. Some also <laughs> want to do something else. So I'm just going to see what they have for me today. I can't wait. 
But can you tell us a little bit about what exactly is going to happen today? All right. Today, I just want each and every one of you to prepare me a rice dish for a toddler. You get me? Rice dish but for a toddler. But you're toddlers, aren't you? <laughs> okay. That's amazing. Good challenge, Chef. Yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have a guest judge today. And she goes by the name Rafia to Yusif. She is an executive chef at the Buka restaurant up in Osu. Welcome to the show. Thank you very much. So are you ready to, you know, compete? Because, you know, there's got to be some kind of competition between you two today. I know, I'm ready. Okay, so what are you, you expecting as a guest judge? So today I'm expecting nothing but abnormal. I don't want anything simple. I don't want anything normal. Think outside the box and wow me. Someone is going home. Someone is going Maybe home two or so three if you people. Give me anything boring, you're going home today. I think they don't believe it from you. No. Maybe from our guest judge, they don't would. worry. So some one person is going home. One person is going home. What would take someone home today? That's like I said. I don't want anything normal. Think outside the box. Be creative. Be creative. That is what we want. All right. I want to see your hygiene practices. I want to see your enthusiasm. I want to see your creativity. You know, just amaze me. Wow her is what she's saying. Um, but let me introduce the most important people in this competition. My 12, a round of applause for yourself. <laughs> okay, so let me see one action that shows that you're happy to be here. Just one. <laughs> They're all open today. Oh, no, no. <laughs> In fact, I'm excited. And um, unfortunately, it's like the time is up. Yes. So, Chef, I want you to do the honors today. You know what I say when I want them to cook, right? Yes. So, on three, two, one. Start work. We are definitely about to see what they got up yeah. their toques and apron. Yeah. Stick with us.
Welcome back from that very long break. I'm sure you were wondering what's going on. I want to know who's burning. They are all burning. Nyagor. But as you already know, I introduced you to our guest judge this week, Rafiatu. Yes. Now, I know you've not had this experience before with children. Like this I magnitude. No, I haven't. Yeah. I haven't. This is I the knew first it. Time, yeah. Thank God you're <laughs> on this with us. But what do you think, you know? you've noticed about our, ch our kids here today they're all doing almost the same thing so i can't wait to see their plating skills maybe Is that, that will normal as in yeah. how rice pudding rice pudding rice pudding i wanted to see maybe some candied rice or some something elegant I, you know like have you met nanajwa um, yeah i did uh-huh i didn't think that was normal at all rampanzil do you the, the cook? You have children? <laughs> I do. I do have you three. do designs or with their food? <laughs> Maybe with their pancakes. You don't. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, what are you expecting? What will wow you today? So for, for what I've seen, I'm just waiting on the plating skills. Mm. Yes, because it's everything is normal to me. I yeah. see. Well, she says normal. I say I beg to differ because mm -hmm. our children are whipping up some skills. I myself, I won't lie. I have <laughs> never even done in my own kitchen. So please make sure that you're supporting them, encouraging them. And of course, you know, your children at home, tell them when they are making something nice, compliment them. Oh, what are you cutting? Uh, that's um, um, purple cabbage. So are you done with your food? You're clay pot, right? Khadija. Wow, the food looks good. So that's the cheesy rice. Is that omutu? Something like that, okay. You are plating for a baby, so you should consider the baby's stomach. I think that is too much plate. That's too much for a toddler. That's too much. Okay. Do you have time to finish? Wow. What did you do? Get aluminium for it. Put them okay. So you're an Abigail, right? Okay. She wants a ladle, a ladle, ladle. What, what plate are you plating on? And is it going to stand? You rinse them, okay. Is it going to stand? Are you sure? Is this okay? something else or is this okay don't you don't you want to add some sauce to it because it's a bit dry it's like something out of this but you can, you can still that. serve less but when are you going to be doing it remember someone is going home also going to boil it and is it going anywhere yeah, you can it. they can have little portions it's okay 
But let's get cooking, man. We are really close to time. You have 15 more minutes. You have just 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Done. Remember, your garnishes should be edible. All your garnishes should be edible. So if you haven't seasoned your garnishes, if you if you just dump some big chunk of vegetable on your plate, I'm sorry. Khadija, are you okay? And it's for a baby, it's for a toddler. So I don't want to see any trees and plants with their roots on your food. I'm seeing some trees on somebody's food here. Sure. Let's just leave them. Let them make Someone has planted simple. a tree on their food. like restaurant style design. Okay. Oh, you don't want to use a cream cream. You need help. No, you can't it away. But if you cover it too hard, you want to spill your... Kiara, can you see? Come here, come here. Oh, let me do that. You go get to work, don't worry. Okay. I'm oh, you are? Yeah. What I just it? it into the Okay, any side is where it doesn't come up, okay? It's very important for a chef to have a salt at all times. Yeah? Good. What? You want me to taste? Did you say I should taste? It's a portion of Oh, you're day. tasting? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. It's your, your, your portion of the What do you need this like? 15 mm. more minutes. That took you long. Less done. It's not good? And this is the body. Why don't you just do the head? Mmm. Mm. But this is too much for But you're not, you're not showing it on your face. Like, what do you think? Okay. <laughs> okay. It's nice to it head, because your is a bit A little over 10 minutes though, but I'll alert you guys. Keep working. Wash your utensils. Mommy and daddy won't wash up after. When you are done, <laughs> you wash it, all right? I'm marking all of that. Your baby is crying, you know, and you are still cooking. <laughs> Yo. You need help. You decide to separate your soup from your. Yeah, it won't be wow! Did you taste your food? Did you taste it? Did you taste it? Can a baby eat that tomato? <laughs> Something is burning though. Okay. Okay. Maybe it's not like Ben's food. Ten more minutes! Ten minutes guys. You should be plating, washing up, 